Well, fashion hasn't always been inclusive or welcoming to models who are not a certain size. But times are changing and plus size models are ruling the runways. WVTM 13's Carla Wade introduces you to a woman who says loving the skin you're in should always be on trend. A lot of women spend an entire lifetime learning to accept their bodies from ups and downs on the scale, pregnancy, and just getting older can be difficult. But plus size model and educator Latoya Nicole Fletcher wants more women and men to embrace body positivity through Birmingham Full Figured Fashion Week coming to Birmingham this summer. Here's LaToya Nicole Fletcher rocking the runway. She started modeling back in 1999 as an undergrad at UAB and has been doing it off and on ever since. My inspiration, of course, was Beverly Johnson, Naomi Campbell, and Tyra Banks. I remember sitting in my brother's hair salon every Sunday, I'm sorry, every Saturday as a teen, just looking at all the supermodels like Naomi Campbell, Cindy Crawford, Claudia Schiffer, Claudia Schiffer of course, and them being like five foot nine and 11 and six foot, and I'm like, here I am five foot three, but I always admired beauty. She's taught middle school and college courses, saying teaching is her gift, but fashion is her passion. Well, America, as we know, is one of the biggest uh, body types in the world. Uh, we love to eat here in America, particularly here in Birmingham, Alabama. So I feel like uh, people are embracing who they are and because they're embracing who they are. They're embracing um, how, how the fashion industry has changed. With that change comes more opportunities for plus size models like herself. I went through a terrible divorce in 2016. I was twice the size. I started modeling. I was a size 8 in the beginning and then I shot up to a size 16 and now I'm a size 20. But I am here to tell you being twice the age, standing here at 47, uh, that it can be done. I have graced the covers of the third and fourth biggest plus size magazines in the world, Curvy Cali the magazine and Queen Size. So fashion has changed, uh, the body has changed, and society is now embracing those curves and they're loving those curves. And so that's why I want you to know that no matter your height, no matter your size, race, color, ethnicity, there is a platform here for you. And she wants to give that same platform, allowing her to shine at every size to more women and even men here in Birmingham. I've also been a former magazine owner and I've also managed other models and have taught other models and talent as well. The reason why I started this was because I noticed that here in Birmingham, Alabama, there's a vast or a well of talented people who are not necessarily discovered or they don't have the platform allowed to them to be able to showcase their talents. Full Figured Fashion Week hits Birmingham in June. But first, there's a citywide casting call for models, Sunday, April 7th. Make sure you come out, you dress in your all black, make sure you have your fitted clothes, you have your heels on, um, make sure you have your black, your nude, um, your heels. We want male, females, um, ages five and up. We also have some great and phenomenal local boutiques that will be featured during Fashion Week, such as the Pink Icing Boutique and the Walk-In Closet, both located in Bessemer, Alabama. And we have some fashion designers coming from New York, New York, such as Coretta Maria of Flavors of Fullness. We have Michelle's House of Designs from Chicago, Illinois, and we have C Denim live from um, Atlanta, Georgia. And if that wasn't savvy enough, she's using some of her fashion sensibility to give back. Some proceeds of the event will go towards scholarships for financially strapped students. For more information on that scholarship and the model auditions, you can go to Birmingham Full Figured Fashion Week.com. Carla Wade, WVTM 13.